Hi there, Bernard Meyerberg here again. Today I would like to discuss the key elements that you need to consider when you want to start an online business. Now, you want to ask me then, uh, but why is it important? Why do I need to have an online business these days? Now, one of the reasons is the current economic climate we live in. People are losing their jobs. Um, it's, it's, it's tough out there for brick and mortar businesses, etc., etc. And, you know, five years ago, it was um, people did extra businesses or home-based businesses uh, just to get another income, just a second income. These days, the internet is creating CEO-like incomes. Um, so it's a primary income. Um, uh, people are doing this because um, th that's the way out. They, they, have, they might have lost their job or whatever the case may be. They didn't want to go on with, uh, with a brick and mortar business and they decided on an, on an online business that gives them really, really good incomes. I mean, if you look, if you look at, for instance, a franchise these days, you know, you pay 200000 to $2 million uh, for a franchise and that's a very expensive job actually because, I mean, you're not free there. You have to put in a lot of hours there. You have a lot of debt that you need to work off. So why don't you position yourself on the internet, leverage the power of the internet 24-7, and you can decide when you want to work and from where you want to work. That is really what the internet gives you. And you don't need experience. You don't need knowledge about internet marketing because it, you can learn that. You can learn that in a very short period of time. I mean, in a matter of two months, you can have enough knowledge to make a good income in the internet, on the internet. And, you know, in six months, you can really be able to, to earn CEO-like incomes. So, you know, I would say focus on the model of the 21st century, and that is the internet. Leverage that and, and, and get yourself positioned there. Now, to do that, I think uh, one needs to look at, at key elements that's important when you make your decision on what type of business you want to do. And I want to discuss four of those key elements. I'm going to discuss two with you now and on another video, another two. Um, first of all, you must see or look if that business um, or system has longevity, you know. Um, is it older than two years? Because if it's older than two years, they have already gone through the mill. You know, they have sorted out their problems, um, they have adapted, and they're still there on the internet. So that is, that is very important. You don't want to get into a business and six months down the line, they don't exist anymore, or they actually had to, uh, or they're not that effective because they can't adapt to the changing circumstances. Um, the other thing is, um, do they actually, or are they the, a leader in the, in, in, in the industry? Do they know what they're doing? Um, do they adapt to the uh, changing circumstances? Um, do they innovate? Because that is very important. And also, um, are they, are, are, is this system or this community, do they have a mission that will test the, uh, you know, that will stood the test of time, that will really be there in five years' time? Because that, that, that will drive people, and if, if the goal is big enough, uh, results will come. Um, so, so that's the things that you need to look at if, if that business, is there longevity involved? Because you're not going to start this business to be gone in six months. Okay. And then the second thing is, what is the product or service that you get out of this business? Um, is it a product that people need? Um, if, if it is a product that people need and that they will use, most probably there will also then be a market for it. So the minute there is a need and that need is satisfied, you, you will be able to, to, to sell that product or to render that service or it will do it by itself. Okay, so that is, that is very important regarding, regarding the product is that it, it, it must be something that people can have value. They must have value. And then when you look at in, in business terms, um, is it a top tier product? Does that product um, ha have good bonus structures? Do they pay five hundred, a thousand, two thousand, even five thousand um, dollars? Because then you don't need to sell a lot of product. You don't need to sell thousands of products a month just to make ends meet. So, this is two of the four elements 
that you need to go and look at when you are looking at starting an online business. In the next video, I will discuss another two with you. See you at the next video. Bye-bye.